hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel i am lost yes one week is getting lost on youtube yes <laughs> and it's because of the jumia black friday so the jumia black friday sale started i believe in somewhere in the beginning of november and it's going all the way to the end of november and i had to buy something the economy is awful guys awful especially on imported goods terrible crazy like things that used to be like happened or two years ago are literally three times the price so it's getting tricky to buy things and i was so glad that uh the black friday actually sale came on this is one of the money saving tips buy stuff when they are on sale and i don't mean sale like fake sales like real sales like monitor the price of the product and then when the product goes on sale buy it but if you have the money buy it at any point you know so i'm just going to start off with a couple of things that i got not on jumia but just in a boutique that i bought around town this um product it's a uh, eyelash glue but it's not marketed as an eyelash glue it's marketed as an eyeliner so you can't even know because look at it, it's written magic eyeliner you really know that it's an eyelash glue just written no glue needed and that's when you'll know <laughs> and that's when you'll know there's nowhere where it's written two in one no it has i love the simplicity of their eye their you know their pen like it just has a writing and then eyes this one i got it at 500 bob i'm sure if you go to dubois if you're in nairobi you'll probably get it because it was just a beauty whatever beauty product so that's how the eyeliner looks that that's just one swatch it's such a game changer because i don't know maybe these things have been around and i don't know that's the problem because if they've been around i might not just have come across them you know i mean it's so easy if you're so poor at doing lashes so the next thing that i also got are uh, nails and you guys remember that i've just been putting my nails short for the whole of this year applying normal polish no gel polish no nothing and that's because i got an infection with some bacteria that turns your nails green not fungi bacteria actually that turns your nails green and i was so disappointed so i had to like cut 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 off all my nails until it grows out temptation i just have to go back to this and these are just like small ones they're just glittery they were so affordable they were 250 kenya shillings this ones i just bought from that boutique now for the moment we've all been waiting for the stuff that i got on the jumia black friday sale i've been a lifesaver because i don't live in nairobi as i said and i have to get products and i don't need to buy a border vehicle or something to just go buy beauty products you know so i normally buy them off jumia and specifically mostly off official stores because stuff and it is time to show you the stuff that i got at the jumia black friday sale of 2022 <laughs> it's actually my birthday week like oh uh, this video will come up on next week but the whole of this week as i'm filming this whole of this week is my birthday week and yeah i did not post and now from next week is when this video will go up yeah near christmas and not only are we near christmas as you can see the outfit can even tell you like if you see me pulling out this glitzy top i think i've had this top for like three four years if you see me pulling out this glitzy top you just know it's that time of the year which is christmas and sales and buying things yes the economy is bad but hey I'll, there's a video i did called how to shop or how to like plan your stuff on a budget or something of the sort i'll link it in the description box below because right now is the most important time for such tips guys you guys know what's happening in the world everything has skyrocketed it's crazy at least so the first thing that i got i've actually used it to cre create this makeup look and you guys might think that this is my perfect perfect foundation shade I'm also beginning to think that it is but 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 i'm going to insert for you a clip of how um when i applied it it looked because honestly it's like uh it's like my face skin is normally too dark for my neck so uh when i applied it on my face it was like crazy you know and this is the foundation i'm talking about which is the l'oreal true oh it's written in french a cop parfait 
I hope I'm not about to accord parfait. I don't know. True, it, it's called the L'Oreal True Match Foundation. And this is the shade 8C, which is Noisette or Nut Brown. Now, the problem is that when I applied it on my face, it was not my foundation shade for my face skin. But for matching for my neck, I'd say it has done a really good job. It's like it's oxidized or something because I've not added anything. But... Mm. kind of like the undertones were kind of wrong like i would have gone with a neutral undertone than a cool one because um i normally wear neutral tones but this one is like too cool and my face matches my hand so if you can see how different my hand looks from my face you can tell that it wasn't really my foundation shade but 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 when it comes to the quality of this foundation guys when it comes to the quality of this foundation i'm so happy that that vendor was selling it but there was the vendor let me see but i'll link that vendor's name in the description box below the vendor was uh zoo beauty limited i'm so happy that zoo beauty limited was on jumia because i wanted this foundation so bad and i was thinking of importing it and as i said Things are not good now. <laughs> yeah, so this is the L'Oreal True Match Foundation. And this is the shade Nut Brown. This foundation is so lightweight. Like, I wish I can just do a whole video on it. It is so lightweight. I've never seen such a lightweight foundation that produces such good results. It's light. It's like you're applying water, but it produces color. How? I don't... Yes. Even when you just pump it, it just runs down, you know, and that is just... Mm. It's just mm. you don't feel like you're working with a mask on you know enough about the foundation that was too much information on one product the next package that i got was actually from the ely colors uh store their official distributor and i had to get this concealer this one was a thousand bob which is a whole series on the difference between this original one and the thick one so it did come first of all let me open it i've already opened the paper that was on top the paper there was a paper on top i think you guys know what this is so i don't need to go into details i'll go into details on this product when i'm doing the original versus the fake one yeah because the, the i've used the fake one a lot so i know okay next we have from the la girl store official distributor this illegal lipstick now the reason i bought this black lipstick it's been so long since i bought this type of lipstick the original lipsticks let me just remove this cab sticker i've not opened this one so this is the cab sticker quality mark and then um yeah this is like an old lipstick i've seen it around for several years probably even decades but it's black and i wanted a black lipstick because i've been seeing this trend on tiktok that i'm going to try <laughs> these trends on tiktok are going to finish me people this world you have to do what you love if you don't i'm sorry so the product is very little inside as you can see but the price was also very very affordable it's black in color and i'm gonna swatch it for you as you can see these are the liners okay it's, it's okay it's okay you know it's an old school lipstick it feels very moisturizing like it's not matte and dry and like the color is not super black you know tell you the economy is bad so you guys better believe that the economy is bad <laughs> because this is the last package and if you've watched my previous year's jumia hauls you know that i used to get a ton a ton of products hey so this is the last package and in here I even bought deals can you imagine because they were on sale i wanted two and this is for one for women one for men and this one is uh this one has a thousand bob if i would bought it if i were to buy it in the supermarket but uh around 900 and something in the supermarket but because i bought it on sale on jumia and because i was buying other products like i wouldn't have bought this if i wasn't buying other products you know uh, because I was buying other products, I bought it at 630 shillings on Jumia, and that was a win. A win is a win, guys. A win is a win. A win is a win. I don't care what y'all say. A win is a win. Right? And it's this Beauty Blenders. I do have some Beauty Blenders. There are two. 
and they are so ratchet like they look like a rat bitching to eat i don't even know what is happening here like and they are new these ones are new like i don't think they are more than two months old they're not even a month yeah not more than two months old but just look at that I don't know the lifespan of a beauty blender is really really short or maybe i'm the one who doesn't know how to care for them so i decided to, to get these ones they were super affordable i can't remember but i'll just for you, insert for you the price and i hope that this is a reusable container because i've not opened it yes it's reusable ah i'm so happy at least i have a home for these beauty blenders so we have like this white one pink yeah at least you know somewhere they can stay because my beauty blenders have just been hanging on top of my brushes, which I don't think is very, very healthy. So, and I hope this container won't let me down. Okay. It's really trying to. Okay. Yeah, it snapped back. So, I think one beauty blender here is like 200 bob or 150. One. So for all these four plus the container, which is a bonus, a storage area, I think that was a good, good deal. You guys obviously, obviously know that I was not going to go out of this sale without a Maybelline lipstick because I love their Superstay ink lipsticks because they are so Superstay. They actually, those things don't budge. Let me be honest. They don't budge. Like my cellar water won't remove it. Makeup wipes won't remove it. You have to use a combination of very many products to remove them. And so I decided to buy a Superstay uh, Matte Ink. And this uh, this particular shade is in the Spice Edition because they've been producing like different editions, like Coffee Editions, that they first started this Superstay range. Um, so this one is in the Spice Collection, which I believe came out like two years ago or one year ago. I'm not sure. I'm seeing them where I can buy them from. And this one is called Short Collar and it's red. And to me, when I received the package, because I didn't know exactly what shade of range it was, I felt like it was very, very close to Pioneer, which I have. So I was kind of disappointed. But when I swatched it, I saw that they were kind of different. And I just felt like uh, Pioneer, this is... As you can see, maybe my lighting is the one that is poor. Let me wipe this Pioneer package properly because I've stayed with it for a while. So this is Pioneer. So the one on top is Pioneer and the one on the bottom is Short Collar. As you can see, Pioneer is kind of darker, slightly darker, while Short Collar looks more of a true, true red. But we are gonna swatch them on our hands so that we can just see so this one that i'm swatching is pioneer almost very similar the applicator looks lighter the applicator on short color is lighter of course because it's more recent so of course they've improved their applicators but i think i just need to use it i need to use it so i'm just going to wipe this carefully so i'm just going to apply this without even uh maybe i should do a little bit of color just a little bit so so that it doesn't bleed jesus is lord as you can see it's more of it has some orange in it compared to pioneer and this applicator removes so much lipstick i should not have double dipped wow it does look really really good so that's the color shot color shot color yeah you do look like you call the shots Thank you so much guys for watching make sure you're subscribed like and uh, comment down below what was your favorite product what product you could get by then there was one product i didn't get which is the Garnier vitamin c i saw it was on sale at 800 bob then i took too long to get the product i took like some days like three days later is when i got this product and uh by the time i was getting these products like going to pay for them the product was sold out it was already out of my cart 
out of my cart it was kicked out of my cart and it was labeled as sold out so i lost that opportunity to get it because i know that right now um the vendors who are selling it on jumia themselves are now selling it at 2000 or around 1800 around there and it was on sale for 800 bob from the l'oreal store so basically that was a waste and uh what else yeah so make sure that you guys when you see a product during this sale grab it because people are grabbing products and they will soon be sold out see you in my next video bye mm -hmm.